Hi everyone and welcome back to my uh, YouTube channel Diamond Paintings with Mike. Today we've got an unboxing of some Halloween washi tape and uh, I wasn't too sure if it was going to come today because on the tracking it just said um, package being prepared at Huntington which is in uh, the offside of Cambridgeshire and I thought oh this ain't going out for delivery today and then it uh, just turned up but it didn't say out for delivery so yeah a bit naughty but uh, at least it's here now. But anyway, so we've got some Halloween washi tape. I've been introduced to uh, washi tape through a friend of mine. Um, and I saw this, which I thought would go really well with my Halloween painting. So this is obviously Italian options. And no, it's uh, uh, really, really good. But on here, look how nice that looks. Happy Halloween writing. This was a whopping £3.50 for this. And then when I checked it online again, it's dropped down to two qu uh, t three quid. So that's very naughty. But um, I saw this and I thought this is absolutely great. I'm really happy with this. I've ordered the skeleton one as well. But the idea is with this washi tape is I thought that would be really, really thin. Um, the amount of new things I'm finding about diamond painting. But as you can see, it's got this lovely logo on it, Happy Halloween as well. It's quite thinner than this thick one, but they do come in all shapes and sizes, as you can see. It's got a hell of a lot more roll uh, tape on it than the Christmas versions. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our Halloween painting. And the idea is, is that we put it down the side of here so that we don't get dust to it. So what we're gonna do, we're going to uh, as you can see, we've got the top part here. So I'm gonna bring that up a little bit. And what I want to do is, just gonna, there we go. Let's just move that a bit. And what we're gonna do is, we're gonna basically put this on here. Now you can use washi tape for all sorts of things. And uh, yeah, okay. Just gonna see what's going on here. There we go. Oh, that looks lovely. So it's a lot thinner, but you don't really need a lot. Just, you know, enough that... Okay, that's not good. <laughs> What's going on here? Okay. But basically, this is great. I mean, you can use this for all sorts of things. You know, if you're wrapping parcels, um, you know, it's just really, really lovely. But you see, the idea is, is then I can put that along there and it won't get any dust on it. So, do you see what I mean? So I might take that up a little bit because it's a little bit over the ear edge a bit. So let me just reposition that. But yeah, I, I just, I love anything that has logos on it. So I'm just gonna put it, I just wanna try and get it as close to that line as possible. So can you see, and then I can just put that across there like that. And then it's got that happy Halloween. Now, if you wanted to, what you could do is you could use that in your, um, you know, as the frame as well. So I'm just going to put that across there like so. And then I'm going to do it exactly the same on this length down here. So it just stops dust getting on the sides. So, yeah, moving forward, I'm going to be buying washi tape. And I'm trying to get it all into proper themes. So let me just do that. As you can see, I'm actually filming this on the 1st of September. So I'm trying to get this painting all ready for set up in uh, October. So you don't want to go too close, but just, you know, right as best to the edge as possible, as you can see. It will cover that colour chart, so just be mindful of that. So I'll just put that there. But what I can do is on the, on the other side, if we just move this one over a bit, I'm not going to go the full way up because we need to get to that colour code. So I'm just going to take this side a little bit. We'll take it to about, I don't need to see them writings as long as I can see the symbol, but that's gonna cover it slightly. So what I'm gonna do is just do this part up to here. And then we'll just have to 
try our best on that part. Um, but yeah, this is, do you see what I mean? It's just so lovely. Okay, so that's that part. Then what I'm gonna do, so I'm gonna move this down here and I'm just gonna do the bottom bit now. But as I said, you can use this for anything. You know, if you wanna put, say a card and you want a sentiment, you could tape a bit of that in the card. You can use it to wrap gifts up at Christmas. It's just brilliant. I mean, washi tape is basically for crafting things, but I think it's great. And then obviously once we've, you know, done all this painting, we can then take this tape off. But I really wanted to make this a really sort of Halloween sort of style painting. So, yeah. So that's what you get. So as you can see, I've now put it all across the top, all down the side and all over here and up there. It just stops, as you can see, like dust getting there and then getting into the painting. But that is just, I'm really happy with that. And I've still got loads of uh roll left so i could use that for like wrapping parcels up it's really good like if you send someone a gift what you could do is say that's the address for example you can just put a piece of tape along there and as you send it sorry hang on Okay, um, so I had a package there, but anyway, so uh, yeah, so they're all starting to come in now, isn't it marvellous? <laughs> but anyway, that's what we do, and as I said, if you wanted to send someone a gift, you could just go, like, put a piece of tape along there, and, um, you know, it makes a nice sentiment. But anyway, that's the Halloween tape. I cannot tell you how happy I am with this painting, and now that we've got the tape on, I can really start to get started with this. But I hope you like that video. Please remember to like, share and subscribe. Remember to tap the bell if you want to be notified of all this video. If you want to get this um, washi tape for yourself, I will put the link in the description below. And I'll see you very soon. Bye.